Greetings and salutations, I am your humble Adobe instructor, AJ Wood, and you're watching episode number 46 of I Create Content. Hey everyone, appreciate you tuning in to today's show. If you caught our last episode, we were talking about exporting images inside of Adobe Lightroom. Today, I've got a quick tip for you on using the dodge and burn tools inside of Photoshop. Let's go ahead and jump on in. You can see on the screen in front of you, I've got this image of the Grand Canyon. We're familiar with this. I shot it many years ago. And what I wanted to point out was the dodge and burn tools, which in CS5 have a new option called protect tones. Now this option to protect the tones will minimize clipping in the shadow and highlight areas, but more specifically, it'll keep any color shift from happening. So because these are destructive paintbrush tools, I'll go ahead and duplicate the background layer. So I'll just grab this brush. I'm going to affect the midtones first. I'll set the exposure to 50%. I'm just going to paint here in the clouds and you can see what a nice job it does pulling back some highlight detail there, uh, giving the clouds a mood. I'll change my range to the shadow areas. I'm going to drop the exposure down to about 25%, paint down in the mountain region, and see here in the caverns, does a good job pulling that in. And then I can switch to my dodge tool, which would lighten. Again, I'll use the midtones, I'll drop that to about 25%. If I want to bring back any highlights here in the front, I could do that. And you can see this is our before and this is our after. So a destructive workflow with existing paint tools isn't always a bad thing. I know we talk a lot about non-destructive editing and we talk about layers and layer masking, but sometimes it's just okay to grab a tool that works do a quick brush job, and then you're done. So, my name's AJ Wood. If this video helped you out, please give it a thumbs up. As always, I appreciate it when you subscribe to this YouTube channel. I create the videos in response to your questions every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. You can catch me on Facebook, on Twitter, on Google+, my blog, ajwood.com, or here on the YouTube channel. So you guys have an excellent afternoon, and I'll see you next time.